Hello everybody, Conti here with another video. How to make a voice on an MP3 audio track sound robotic in DaVinci Resolve 16.2.2. Inside your cut window, hold Ctrl and press I to insert a media file that you wish to use in this project. Use Command instead of Ctrl if you are a Mac user. The techniques that you are about to see can be applied to MP3 files or can be applied to audio tracks in video files such as MP4 for example. Inside your Media Pool Master Bin, select the thumbnail of your chosen media file. Hold Shift and press F12 to append this particular file to your timeline. Go to click on the Fairlight tab at the bottom of your screen. Select the audio file on the Fairlight timeline which you wish to manipulate. Go to Inspector and go down to Clip Pitch. Semitones refers to the interval between two different notes which make up your pitch. If I were to reduce the value for this property, the voice in the audio file becomes very deep. Setting the semitone to a positive value on the other hand, will ultimately increase the pitch of the voice on your audio file. For this particular scenario with the robot voice, I'm going to reduce the semitone to minus 3. Sense basically refers to the adjustments for each semitone. Each semitone comprises of 100 cents, like 100 cents in one US dollar. If we were to decrease this value, the voice sounds deeper and more raspy. Whereas increasing the sense value makes the audio track run much smoother. To enhance the robotic tone, I'm going to reduce the sense value to minus 15. Go to your effects library. Underneath audio effects, go to find pitch underneath Fairlight effects. Click and drag this filter to your chosen audio file on your Fairlight timeline. A pitch window should automatically appear. At present my voice sounds very deep and lacks a robotic electronic edge. Increasing the semitones here increases the pitch of the overall audio file just as we did with the clip pitch underneath Inspector. What I'm going to do here is set the semitone to plus 5. In order to add a stereotypical high pitch tone to your robotic voice, what you can do is increase the sense here to 100. And finally, in order to mix the high pitch tone with your deepened voice, we are going to decrease the output to 44. Maintaining the deep vocals and giving this a high pitched ending echo effect. Should you close down this pitch window and wish to access these properties once again, Go back to Inspector, scroll down to the bottom to find your pitch settings. The same window can be opened with the button on the right side to the bin, where you can customise your pitch effect again. To deactivate this pitch filter at any time, left click on the red button next to the pitch label, and the voice recording will return to normal. To remove this filter altogether, simply left click on the bin icon which appears to the right of the pitch label. Thank you very much for watching, I hope that video was useful to you. If you enjoyed the content and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Join me soon for another video, take care.